Welcome back, my brave warriors. This is phase four, and this is your comeback. Let's continue that comeback with some shoulder rolls. So just roll those shoulders, just like this, doing good. Just keep doing it. And I want you to emphasize the lower part of your shoulders, your shoulder roll. I want you to root that shoulder down, root it down. There you go. Pulling down the bottom part of it, getting that scapula, like I always say, in your back pocket. Engage the abs while you're at it too. Bring it up and let's go the other direction. Let's start celebrating those little victories you're having now. Most likely, you're at a point where you're brushing your teeth. Wow, thank you for my ability to brush my teeth, right? That's a big deal now, right? Using a seatbelt, being able to put it on yourself, maybe being able to put your shorts on yourself and not having somebody help you. This is a winner. Be happy about it. Tell your friends, get silly, get excited about it. Maybe you're using a fork with that hand if it's your dominant hand. Good, keep going and Let's go ahead and relax. Now we're gonna get the, what's called the Terry's minor muscle. Very important. Get a uh, 90 degree angle. We can do both if you like. And then we're just gonna externally rotate and pinch the shoulder blades. Coming forward, touch the pinkies together if you can. And then coming back, externally rotate and pinch the shoulder blades. Good, I'll get the side angle for you. So you're gonna come here, externally rotate to the end range motion that you can, that's comfortable, and pinch. Good. As I've been saying in all the videos, keep in contact with your healthcare provider. This virtual experience here does not completely make up for seeing someone in person. You want to have a post x-ray, making sure everything is healing properly. You wanna have somebody on your team that's getting their hands on you. Keep going, do this one at your own risk. And pinch just like that. Good. And pinch. This is gonna be a nice long video. We're gonna get a lot in. Here we go. And now we're gonna bend your knees and then hinge at the hips. Toes are pointed straight ahead. And we're gonna bring the arms back a little bit if it's comfortable, and we're gonna get the triceps. So contract the triceps. Contract just like that, good. Palms are down, keep going. It, abs are engaged. Your scapula are pulled in your back pocket. You're in a neutral spine with a little bit of an arch in the low back though, with the weight down in through the heels. Nice and slow. Ooh, if you just get a good pinch, I mean, you can get a little workout of these triceps. Probably not like the workouts you used to do, but we are going to get there. Pinch. Good. Perfect. Good. Pinch it. Beautiful. Pinch it and then come up for a second. Take a breath. Now we're gonna do some rowing, okay? So just come forward like that. Same, just like we were, the arms go down and we're gonna just row like this. Just like that. And just row. Pull the shoulders down towards the butt. Engage your abs. Weight goes down in through the heels. And we're just rowing, just like this. This challenge isn't breaking you. It may have broken your arm, but it's not breaking you. Your spirit is intact. Good, pulling those shoulders down. Good. Pull the shoulders down. Hopefully you're off of all medication at this point. Keep doing it. Good, so let's do a few, you know I love these pinch and curls, so we're gonna do a few of those. So we're gonna curl and pinch. Curl and pinch. Curl and pinch. Curl, pinch. 
Have you been able to tie your shoe yet? I hope so. If not, we're getting there soon. Pinch, curl, pinch. Beautiful. Let's do a little, I'm always using my left hand throughout this whole series. Um, we're gonna do an active pendulum. So we're gonna come forward, lean forward, and we're just going to actually use your arm now and we're gonna do some circles. Just like a, you can do them like the size of a large pizza. Just a big circle. There you go. The shoulder is so amazing. It's, it has more range of motion, I think, than any other joint in the body. Maybe not, yeah. It's, but with that mobility comes some vulnerability. We have to get these muscles activated and then the other way, otherwise we will lose it. Those ligaments can't be the ones that just hold the shoulder together. We have to have the muscles sort of act as ligaments, holding the thing together. Good. If you can only do just like a small plate or a small pizza right now, that's fine. Big pizza would be nice. And I think you're ready for it in this video. Good, you're probably getting a little sore. So let's just take a quick break right now. And we're back. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and move your, your nose and we're gonna go up and down like this. Up, and down, good. So we're doing a diagonal line with your nose, still keeping that neck in shape. And then let's go ahead and do the other direction. So you do the mirror image of what I'm doing. You can go up to the upper left and the upper right and lower left and give me a few more. Okay, let's get back to some arm movements. We're gonna go, we're gonna take that hand and we're gonna go to your hip. So hand to the hip and hand to the other hip. Here we go, hand to the hip, hand to the other hip. This is crossing the body. There we go. Just like that. Hip to hip. Good. You're wearing courage like a badge on your sleeve right now. You are courageous. I want you to say, I am strong. Let's hear it. Good, one more time. I am strong. Good. Let the weak man say, I am strong. There we go. Let's do a little pendulum. I'm gonna lean over again, and we're gonna just do a little pendulum. Again. In the other direction, go for it. If you just came on board and you found me a little bit later in the process, welcome. Glad you're here. Okay. So now we're going to go for, instead of hip to hip, we're going to go hip to shoulder. Okay. As much as you can, as much as you feel comfortable. So we're going to go hip to shoulder right there. There we go. Hip to shoulder. Yep, beautiful. Good job. To shoulder. Where's that smile? Keep it up. To shoulder. Chest is up. That's it. I'm honored to be a part of your day right now. To be getting through this with you. 
obviously this isn't the uh, get a ton of video views video. This is the video because I have compassion for what you're going through. And so this is why I put this together. I want to help you. There we go. Keep going. Nice. And you're probably doing this much slower than I am, and that's okay. If it's, if it's here, and maybe you need a little help at the end, that's okay too. Okay, let's go ahead. We're gonna do some biceps, and when we do the biceps, we're gonna we're gonna go pronation into supination like this, and see if you see how high you get. You can get into supination, just like that. Pronation, there you go. Perfect. Straighten, and now I want you to at the at the bottom. I want you to contract your triceps and then at the top, contract the biceps. So it's you stop for a second, contract, contract, just like that. Contract, contract, beautiful. Contract the triceps, contract the biceps. Okay, okay so the next move here is um, we're going to do um, what I call a prayer lift. So we're gonna just put our hands in a prayer position. You're going to be using your strong arm to help your weaker arm, okay? So we're just going to lift like this. See if you can get it to the level of your eyes. See if you can cover your eyes with your hand. Or maybe you go a little bit further than that. Coming down. There you go. Even further. Okay. Or if you're here, it's fine right now. Just do what you have. Soon we'll be doing these with weight in our hand. Okay, now I'd like you to get a broomstick. I'm gonna go get mine. So here we are, we have our stick. I want you to grab it like this. I like your in involved side uh, palm up. Your uninvolved side palm down gives you a little more power. And so we're gonna start and we're gonna just move that arm. We're gonna stretch it this way. If you're down here, that's okay. And just stretch. And just make sure we clean those ranges of motion, right? And never lose them again. And then bring it down. And then we're going to come up. Up, 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 up. Just what you can do. Up. And holding it. Holding it. Take a breath. And then bringing it down. Beautiful. Now, next one we're going to do is elbow bent. And we're going to do external rotation like that. Please show these videos to your healthcare providers. We want to make sure they are on track with what you're doing. Good, let's do one more time. We're going to bring it up. And then come down a bit. And then we're going to go over to the side. do external rotation again, just like that. Okay. Now we're going to 
take it just like this, put it right in front of you. And if you can, help your hand up here. Bring the stick out in front of you. Step back a little bit. I'm just going to try to see if we can get a little stretch just like this. You need to put both hands on. You can put both hands. You can bring it in the center and just stretch out a little bit here. Good, coming down. Excellent. Do a couple of my videos a day. When you're ready, go to phase five.